In a time when spring was just a memory and summer a distant dream, a couple of sparrows reveled in the comfort of their cozy nest. High up in the robust arms of a towering tree, they were protected from the elements, their tiny home a testament to their hard work and dedication. The forest was their playground, the sky their endless canvas, and the tree their sanctuary. Their days were filled with the sweet symphony of the forest, and their nights brought the soothing lullaby of rustling leaves. But as the wheel of the year turned, the warmth of summer faded, replaced by the biting chill of winter. The forest, once a vivid painting of green, was now a stark tableau of white. The once bustling forest was silenced by the cold, replaced by the monotonous drone of winter rain. Among the shivering inhabitants of the forest was a monkey, cold, wet, and without a home. Seeking refuge, he chanced upon the sparrows, cozy in their nest. Jealousy gnawed at him, the sight of their warm, dry nest, a stark contrast to his own plight. The female sparrow, perhaps out of concern or maybe out of arrogance, mocked the monkey for his lack of foresight. Why don't you have a home, she asked, her words laced with derision. The monkey, taken aback, felt the sting of her words. In retaliation, he cast aside the wisdom of an old saying, never give advice unless asked. Consumed by rage and humiliation, he shook the tree violently, sending the sparrow's nest tumbling to the frozen ground. The sparrows watched in horror as their home was destroyed, their sanctuary ruined. The story of the sparrows and the monkey is a poignant reminder of the consequences of unsolicited advice. The sparrows lost their home, and the monkey was left with the guilt of his actions. Their tale is a lesson in humility and respect, urging us to think before we speak, to consider the consequences of our words. To give advice is to assume a position of superiority, and to receive it unsolicited can feel like an attack. So before we rush to guide others, let us remember to ask if our advice is wanted. After all, the bliss of harmonious coexistence lies in respecting the boundaries of others. As we journey through life, let us remember the tale of the sparrows and the monkey, a reminder that our words, like the winter wind, can have a profound impact. So let us choose them wisely, for the echo of our words can reach further than we can see. In the grand theater of life, let's respect each other's roles. And remember, every creature, no matter how small, plays a part in the symphony of existence. And so the tale of the sparrows and the monkey ends, but the lessons it imparts linger on, a timeless reminder to think before we speak. Please like and subscribe.